Our people here are suffering and some of them move a lot of kilometers to fetch for water. We don't drink clean water in Angalatsini. Uh, when they were doing the road around here, the caterpillars came and cut the pipeline off. Since last year, around two, two and a half years, my people are suffering, uh, trying to get water from the water source down here. This seems things bad, uh, things like jams and everything. First you come, first you come. From morning up to eight, if you come late, you wait up to evening hours. Now, the pandemic, if it reaches here, I don't know how we shall survive. Because we are supposed to be washing our hands daily, we are supposed to actually improve our hygiene. And we cannot improve our hygiene where there is no water. Now, this has forced us to come and sit with the deck of, of Moyo to, to check out how we are going to solve this matter and to bring this uh, project on board and to implement this project so that it is, will have a value for money attached at uh, the office of the Prime Minister. And in the meeting, we resolved that uh, if this administrative review is not effected and uh, if they are not responding, we need to go up to OPM's office and uh, to confirm, okay, okay, to inquire exactly. Well, the operationalization of Obong district happened at a time when there are some cross-cutting sub-projects implemented both under Moyo district local government and Obong district local government. This calls for uh, putting our heads together to ensure these sub-projects -pro sub are successfully implemented.